please stand for the flag salute. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What's up, Hawks? Today is Friday, December 9th. My name is Ainsley, and you're watching HNN. Later today, the Think Pink Club is hosting a bake sale outside of the cafeteria starting at 2.45. This is a cash-only fundraiser, and items range in price from $1 to $3. All proceeds will be donated to the Sozin G. Komen Foundation. So stop on by today and pick up a delicious treat. The Gender and Sexuality Alliance Club is coordinating with SportsMed to collect plastic bottle caps. The caps must be clean and must have the correct recycling code. Clean lids and caps can be left in the office for Mrs. Belfield or Ali Jeske, or they can be bagged and brought to room 135 or the athletic training room. The caps will be sent to for recycling and turned into a bench for our school. This drive will continue throughout the year. Students, don't forget that each high school student must complete eight hours of community service prior to the end of semester one of their senior year. The organization must be a nonprofit and the student may not receive payment for these services. Turn in your completed verification form, available in the guidance office, to your student services technician. And the end of the semester is only two weeks away, so seniors, if you haven't completed your service hours by now, time is running out. Also, CSF's annual Teachers vs. Students Volleyball match is back. The game is scheduled for Thursday, December 15th during tutorial and students do not and students do need a ticket to get into the game. Tickets are $1 each and can be purchased with cash in the student store during snack or lunch. So get your tickets before it's too late and we'll see you at the game. And students, don't forget that there is a comedy sports match tonight in the main theater starting at 7 p.m. Tickets are only $7 um, and there will be free pizza during halftime. Now let's send it to Picnopedia with Danny. Hello guys, welcome back to Picnopedia. I'm your host, Danny. Today's guest is Mr. Shrenzel. Hi, Mr. Shrenzel. Hi, Danny. Okay, so we're here at, we want to say where we're at? I, I guess we're in Colombia. Yeah, we are. So like, do you like the coffee here? I love the coffee here. You know why we're in Colombia, right? Yeah. Isn't this like your little life story now? This is my, this is my life and my wife's story. Yeah. yeah. This is, like yeah, so I used to live here for I used to live here in Colombia for five or six years, and oh, I awesome. met my wife there. Congratulations! Or, I mean here because we're here. Oh yeah, in Colombia. Yeah. And we're drinking coffee okay. from here. Talking about your wife, I heard you have a daughter. Um, we have yeah, we have a five. She's like five weeks old. We just had a daughter. Yeah, just had her. We just created a human being. And yeah, she's beautiful. She's Anaya. She's a little girl with yeah. blue eyes and. And she's like the, the new love of my life. She's awesome. Do you do anything interesting with your daughter? Like, do you have a conversation with her? Or like, play around with her? Yeah, I mean, I'm a history teacher, so I talk to her. Like, I'm like, you know, hey, Anaya, what do you think? Because, I mean, what do you yeah. talk to a baby about? So I was like, hey, Anaya, what do you think about Vladimir Putin's invasion of, of Ukraine in 2022? Do you think it's justified? Do you think the United States should get invaded? In, does, does she respond? Yeah, she says, Ah, and, ah, and then sometimes she looks at me like I'm evil and she cries at me. Okay, so like, what made you become a history teacher? Talking about history, you know? Um, I think I just, you know, I used to like traveling a lot. And I think I traveled a lot of the world, like here in Colombia. Yeah. And, and I just think the world's really interesting. And so I'm like, if I can spend time making teenagers in California interested in the world and how it works and how beautiful it is and how crazy it is, and make them passionate about it, that's like my passion in life. You know? Your passion. Get more people to travel and other. think and talk about the world. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. Okay, well, that's a great interview. Now, on to our activity. Is it though? Yeah, on to our activity. What do you got? We're going to teach you how to change little baby Thumbelina's diaper. <laughs> Here's her diaper. Are you going to teach me how to do it? Yeah. Okay. You're, you're a new parent. Well, I spend a lot of time wiping bums now. So okay, so teach me. You're gonna do it. So we put the diaper under you know we already removed the first one. And then we put her in. We wipe her, you know, little wipe. Then Yeah, I don't think you did a good enough job there. I think she might still have some crumbs. <laughs> <laughs> okay now here is Thumbelina in her new fresh diaper. I don't know if that's the right size. You might want to go back to Ralph. <laughs> I didn't get it at Ralph. 
Where'd you get it? CBS. <laughs> Go me. Am I trying? Am I learning everything that you just taught me? Or is yeah. That also, you know, we rock her to sleep. We burp her after we feed her. Oh. We hold her hand. We hold her head a lot because we don't want her head to go like that. We People at home, her. are you learning this for? Don't have kids for a long time, but when you have kids, follow Danny's advice. She knows what she's talking about. Also, babies don't have good vision, so don't be surprised if they cry at you. They yeah. probably see you as the biggie man. They just see you as like a shadow that's coming yeah. after them. And maybe it comes with food, or maybe it comes with like nightmare yeah. material. Okay. Here you go. You want All right. Her? Thank you. Is this? Is it delicate? Is she delicate? She's very tiny. Yeah, she's very delicate. Okay. So. Okay. Well, that, gonna... that's all for today. I didn't even have time to change the, the baby. You could pat this out in the corner. No. Well, that's all for today, folks. See you on the next episode of Picnopedia. Goodbye. Thanks, Danny. Now let's head to Christina with sports. Thanks, Angel. Later today, the boys wrestling wrestling team will compete in the Man Classic at Marina High School with matches starting at 11 a.m. Then tomorrow, sophomore Holly Baker will be the first runner in Laguna Hills history to race in the national championships at Balboa Park in San Diego. Holly will represent the Western United States along with her nine teammates from all over the American Southwest as she competes against the best female runners in the nation. We want to wish her all the best on this historic race. And after Holly's race in San Diego, just cruise up to the five up the five to San Jose and watch our varsity football team take on Bellarmine, Bellarmine College Prep in the state championship game. This is our first trip to the state championship and we hope everyone can make it up to the Bay Area to help support our Hawks on this historic night. Back to you, Ainsley. Thanks, Christina. Good luck to Holly, good luck to football, and we hope that they have a safe trip. And thank you for watching HNN. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at LHHS.HNN and go Hawks. Oh!